Billy. All right. Good afternoon, folks. Happy holidays to you. We are up here at the home ranch today, and it's obviously winter out the last few weeks, cold and snowing and blowing, but we had a pretty good holiday, and we're looking forward to New Year. And My friend Rick down at J.C. Martin Saddles sent us up some gear for us to uh, take a look at and try out here and do a little video for you on some of the new stuff that he's got in his lineup this year and we're gonna take it away with this first saddle pad here that he sent up pretty fancy one Vic's already uh, absconded on this one to match her one of her JC Martin saddles it's got the uh, the wear leathers all around it it's all hand tooled it matches the uh, patterns matches the patterns of a lot of the tooling patterns on the saddles that uh, you can get from J.C. Martin. It's very good quality wool felt. Runs a full three quarters of an inch on this pad, almost to almost an inch actually. And it is also contoured to fit your horse's back, which makes it a lot easier to sit on a horse and and uh, fit on a horse without sliding around and a whole lot of breaking in. Uh, the next pad he sent up here for us to take a look at is this pad here. It again, it's a wool felt pad. It's got the hand tooled Indian type patterns here on the on the uh, on the edges of the wear leathers. Hand painted, hand tooled. Use the same pattern as the saddles down the center. Contoured pad. Pretty nice looking little pad for you bell racers out there. This would be right up your alley. Lots of bling. And then this last pad he sent up here is this pad here. This pad is a is a split wither pad shaped more towards a barrel racing type saddle. Um, has a completely open withers for a real high backed horse or high withered horse. Weather wear leathers, good one inch felt thickness on this pad, nice and firm. So if you got a if you got a horse with extremely high withers that you are looking for a pad for, this might uh, fill the bill for you. So all in all, I like these new pads. I've been riding them. Um, a couple of the other versions that we did a video on a while back, I've been riding them this fall and they work real well on my horses and they've worked real well on some of the students' horses that I've put them on when I'm riding the uh, the wade saddles from J.C. Martin. So the other things I want to talk about a little bit today is uh, Rick has got a line of accessories for your saddle that you can order with your saddles or order them separately. These are pretty nice saddle bags if you guys do any overnight camping or long trail rides where you need to pack some gear along with you. Billy quit. Get out of there. Um, He's got these these got these saddle bags that'll match the color of your saddles. Uh, they can come as an accessory with the saddle in the package, or you can order them separately. These uh, saddle bags retail for about $115, and you might be able to talk them into throwing in a set with a new saddle as well. These saddle pads also start out at $115, so that's a great great buy for you guys for a good saddle pad that's going to hold up for you and work and, work and do the job. Um, he also has, for you hunters out there, rifle scabbards. Now these are not sold, these are not sold separately. These have to be bought in a package with the saddle bags and they're going to run you uh, a little over 200 bucks for the scabbard and the saddle bag combination. These here, these two here are for bolt action rifles and they're pretty well put together pretty nice looking if you're running a bolt action rifle without a scope on it uh, you might fit a small scope in it I don't know for sure I haven't got a rifle to fit them on um, and he also has a, he also has uh, a version of this scabbard that's more for a 3030 type rifle or a carbine without a scope on it and you can talk to Rick about all of these so that's what we got for you today uh, if you're looking for a saddle pad, be sure and go on his uh, Facebook page, jcmartinsaddleartistry.com, or 
JC Martin Saddle Artistry on Facebook and check out this line of stuff. He's also got some head stalls that he sent me that I've been using and I really like the head stalls too but I hadn't I didn't get one of those in and I don't want to speak out of turn by saying you can get those separately so you'll have to talk to Rick about those. So I hope you guys had a good holiday and you got everything you wanted for Christmas. If not, here's something you can put on your list. Y'all have a good one.